Now there's a variation on that which is a lot more advanced and be careful if you have uh, a knee problem or any history of knee trauma and it's a bit of a tricky one to get into. Start on all fours and literally one knee all the way forward and the other knee all the way back. Okay, then grab this foot and twist it around underneath you there so that you're then able to come down on top of the other knee. And that's a really nice stretch into that left, the knee that is in front, the left piriformis muscle. Hold that for 30 seconds, but if you're comfortable, hold it for five minutes. It's my favorite stretch of everything that I've done today. And again, just to show you, in case you're a bit confused as to how to do it on the opposite side, I'll give you another angle. Start in this position here. Bring the front knee as far forward as you can. Take the back knee back. Twist this foot forward around there. And then come down onto it. Uh, as you can see, I can get down reasonably low because of the flexibility of my hips. Some of you might find that you're sort of stuck in a position a little higher up like this and sort of stuck like that. However, just persist with a little bit, it may take some time, but you might be able to get yourself a little bit lower down and a little bit further stretched out. Right.